Yo boys, what's up? Adrian Nickelodeon coming at you from Sydney, Australia. I'm not sure if this unboxing is going to be a separate video or if I'm going to insert this into another video, but today we are unboxing the Olight Warrior X Turbo. Let's try and smash through this as quickly as possible. Here's the box, nice, clean, white. People don't really care about packaging unless it's poorly packaged. Decent packaging on this box. Check that out. Five year warranty on the torch. Nice, glossy print. Looks really nice. 1,100 lumens and up to 1,000 meters range out of the throw of this torch. Let's open it up. Got a little magnetic clasp here on the side. And we've got a little welcome note there. And then we've got some directions on how to first set up the light. So let's yeet that out of here and get the light out. Oof. Let's put that aside for a second and check out the accessories that come with the box. Nice little thank you at the bottom there. All right, so the O-Light comes with a additional ring. Jokes guys, this is a silicon tactical ring that you can replace the belt clip that they've got already installed on the light. It comes with a lanyard, no one ever uses those, and it comes with this thing here, guys, amazing. A magnetic charger to charge the torch without having to take the battery out. Unbelievable. I can't believe how far technology has come over the years. And then you've obviously got a little instruction manual here. Just going through all the points, all of the tech specs. I bet you there's some warranty information on here as well. But as I said, five year warranty on the torch. It's got a one year warranty on the battery. And I believe it's a 30 day warranty on the lanyard. But anyway, here is the torch. This here is the Olight Warrior X Turbo. Absolute work of art. Blue bezel on the top here, knurling down the side of the body. It's got a belt clip here, a little hole here to chuck the lanyard onto if you wanted to use that. Clicky button on the back of the torch, but of course the torch isn't working currently because we've got a tiny little piece of protective film on the inside here. Let's pull that out. And this is the battery. It's proprietary Olight 21700 5000 milliamp hour protected cell battery. So you don't have to worry about overcharging the light if you want to keep this thing constantly plugged into the charger. So we'll just chuck that back in there. We've got two main modes to use with this light. We've got a half click, which will give you 12 and a half hours at, I'm not sure how many lumens that would be. It says here, that mode there is 150 lumens for 12 and a half hours with a throw of 360 meters. And then you've got the high mode, which is a full click, and that is 1,100 lumens for six and a half minutes. Then it'll drop down to 600 lumens for 105 minutes. Then it'll drop down to 300 lumens for 27 minutes. And then finally, it will drop down to 150 lumens for 52 minutes. A Little bit techy, I know, but general gist is you've got a half click, which will give you 150 lumens, and then you've got a full click, which will give you 1,100 lumens, which will also throw the beam one kilometer away. Oh, hey boy, we've got a little lamb out. <laughs> we've got a little lamb outside the door. He can hear me, and he thinks I'm his mum because I've been feeding him. Hey boy. Oh. Hey boy. Boy, what are you doing? Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, hold on, hold on a second. Yeah, we're really doing this in the middle of an unboxing video. Boy, where are you, boy? Come here, boy. Come on, boy. Everyone's waiting. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Hey, boy. All right. Let's try and... Uh, let's try... <laughs> Let's try and get this unboxing video done without any more distractions. So, as I was saying, half click, 150 lumens, full click, 1,100 lumens. It's got an awesome little holster here. They've changed the way that the holster clasps from the past models. So instead of having a little button pin, or what do they call it? Uh, a button clasp. So instead of that, they've now got a magnetic closure. Pretty cool, chuck the light into the holster. It's got a D-ring on the back here, and we've also got some Velcro if you want to attach this to some webbing on a backpack or if you want to attach this to your belt. Pretty cool design of the holster. I don't really travel much with my torches. I use them more around the house, so I probably won't be using the holster even though it is pretty cool quality, but really it's up to you guys. And just on that note, this torch here may not be to everyone's liking, so head over to the Olight website, check out what they've got to offer. They're actually running a flash sale at the end of this month, so 40% off. 
a lot of their discontinued, limited edition and excess stock that they've got on the website. And additionally, I've got a super awesome discount code for you guys. I'm pretty sure it's the biggest discount that you can find online at the moment. They've given me a 12% discount code that I can share with you guys. So if you wanna use Adrian12 at checkout, you'll get 12% off anything that isn't currently discounted or isn't on sale. So again, if this isn't the torch for you, you could always go and pick up something like this thing here, which is the Baton 3. This torch here is unbelievable. It's about the size of my pinky finger and it is brighter than the Warrior X Turbo. Can't believe it. I wasn't really keen on them sending me this little torch because I don't particularly use small torches, but I've been using these torches for a week now and this has been my go-to around the house every single day. It's got a dual direction clip. I know we're doing the Wari X unboxing, but I just wanna show you this real quick. Dual direction clip so you can clip it onto, if I'll just grab a hat real quick, clip it onto the front of a hat and use this as a headlight, clip it into your pants pocket. It's always there, it's light, it's unobtrusive. Every time I go and pick this thing back up, I pull it out of the charge case and it's got a full charge on the battery. But anyway, back to the Olight Warrior X Turbo. This thing also has a battery indicator on it in terms of vibration. If you go to turn the torch on, it will vibrate and I haven't read the user manual, but it will have a different vibration pattern depending on how much charge is in the torch. And I'm sure that if you're using this thing every day, you'll quickly work out which vibration pattern is which. As I said, it's got a large head here that captures the light and throws 250,000 Candela up to one kilometer away or 3,000 feet. Additionally, something that they haven't mentioned in any of their marketing, prints, anything online, none of the other reviewers have mentioned this. This is something that I stumbled across. If you run the light and then turn it off, I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see this. I'll try and show you this at night. There's a little glow in the dark green ring on the inside there. So if you were using the torch and then you put it down and it was pitch black, you'd still be able to find where the torch was for a certain amount of time because that ring is gonna keep glowing. But yeah, guys, unbelievable quality. The threads on this thing are buttery smooth. Let's try and change out this tactical ring and belt clip. Should be able to just slide that off and pull that off. And then we can chuck this on just like that. Screw this back down here. What's the little boy doing? Let's have a quick look. What are you doing, boy? What are you doing, boy? Thanks for being quiet for the review. I'll be with you in a sec. Got to give him 500 mils of milk. Unfortunately, his mama passed away um, a couple of weeks ago, so I've been taking care of him, so he thinks I'm his mum. But anyway, right here we've got the silicon tactical ring on there. As you can see, it fits nicely around the hand right there. If you were to use this as a weapon, you could strike someone with that bezel, with this crowned bezel on the front. You could scratch someone across the face with it. Do it. It'd be quite painful. <laughs> Trust me, it'd be quite painful if you were to use this thing as a weapon. Or you could also use this. Because this light has such a large head, it wouldn't really fit in the pocket very well. I mean, it does fit, but it's a bit bulky. But if you were to carry it by your side, you could carry it between your fingers just like that. Just let it hang. Or you could use this to actually use the light, use that ring to, to get a little bit more purchase on the light to hold it while you're using it out in the field. So anyway, guys, as I said, this light might not be for you. I live on acreage and especially this time of year, we're in lambing season for the past month. So we've got some new lambs. I need to head down there and check on them frequently at nighttime, make sure they're not being taken by foxes and make sure everyone's safe and no one's crying and looking for their mum. So I've been using this thing for the past couple of days and it has just been performing unbelievably well. Oh, sorry, there's another mode there. So we've got a half click, which was 150 lumens, full click, which is the 1100 lumens. And then if you want a tactical intermittent mode, you just press and hold. And then when you let go, it'll turn the torch off. Press and hold, use the torch, let go, it'll turn the torch off. Let me just quickly show you this magnetic charger. You can see there it's got a green light. And then if we were to attach it to the torch, you can see there it's got a red light for charging. So as I said, protected cell battery, you could leave this on charge indefinitely and just pull it off whenever you wanna use the torch and you don't have to worry about any overcharging issues. Magnetic charger, you don't have to take this thing apart. I mean, one of my biggest gripes with my previous torch that I used to use was every time this thing would die, I would have to plug in this battery into an external charger and then chuck it back in there, do it all back up, I'd head down to check on lambs in the middle of the night and the torch would be dead or dying so I wouldn't even know how much charge was in the torch. This, these, the, these torches, unbelievable. Seriously guys, I feel like I've been in a coma and I've woken up into the twilight zone 
And while I've been in that coma, Olight have just been innovating like crazy. So again, vibration battery indicator on the torch, magnetic charger on the back, 1000 meter throw on the 250 candela out of this super tiny little LED. The Warrior X Turbo is also two meters waterproof. I reckon they're pretty cool. I'm glad Olight have come on as a sponsor on the channel. I know this isn't motorcycle related, but I do have some torches that I wanna show you that we would be able to use while we're doing maintenance and other things on the motorcycle. Namely, so this is one of them, the Baton 3 that I showed you guys earlier. This thing is so small that you could easily chuck it in your mouth right, while you're working on a bike in dark spaces and light up your work area so you can get the job done. They also do headlights, they do some stupidly large handheld floodlights. I mean, the, the handheld floodlight, one of the handheld floodlights that they've got is 14,000 lumens. So again, this thing is 1,100. They have a handheld torch that throws 14,000 lumens. It's ridiculous. Anyway, I'm excited to have these guys on the channel. I reckon they've got some pretty cool products that I want to show you guys. Again, if you want to buy any of this stuff off sale, you can use coupon code ADRIAN12 and I'll chuck some links down in the description if you want to check out their website. But again, thank you Olight for sending this sick little torch over to me. And the next review video is going to be a full review on this tiny little pocket rocket, the Olight Baton 3. This thing gives me the fizz. I'm really, really excited to show you guys this little torch. So anyway, guys, we're gonna go do some testing in the dark right now at the end of the video. If you enjoyed the unboxing of the Olight Warrior X, please hit that subscribe button and hit the like button. It really does go a long way in helping me do more of these review videos and showing you guys more products that are pretty damn cool on the channel. But other than that, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Just want to give an honorable mention to this little guy who's been so quiet while we got the review video done. Thanks, buddy. Hey, thanks, boy. Thanks, boy. What a cutie. GoPro, stop recording. <laughs>